biodiversity the term biodiversity is made up of two words one is bio and one is diversity and the meaning of bio is all the living things so it is and the meaning of diversity is variety so it is the term used for the different varieties of the living organisms so all the different varieties available on the earth of the living organisms can be considered as the biodiversity or can be referred as the biodiversity scientists have already identified more than 2 million species on the earth and there are more than 10 of the millions of species which are still unknown to the scientists so so we are having tremendous variety of the life on the earth and this all complex system makes the biodiversity available on the earth now first of all as i told you that there are two millions of species known animal species so it it is divided into several parts for example there are 1.3 millions of only animals available from this group and from this animals almost 1 million are only insect and there are 52,000 vertebrates out of this 52,000 mainly there are 25,000 of the fishes and there are mammals which are only 9% that is 4,000 or 5,000 mammals available on the earth biodiversity now let's talk about the classification of biodiversity biodiversity is divided into three parts one is genetic diversity second is species diversity and third is ecosystem diversity so what is genetic biodiversity so variation among the genes of the same species are known as genetic diversity so if there are same kind of species but they are having different genes then it can be considered as a genetic diversity similarly for example this is the different varieties of the rice so all of them are rice but their genes are different and that's why they are having genetic diversity secondly species diversity for example if there is a variation among the species of one family of the animals so that can be considered as a species diversity for example zebra donkey horses they belong to the same family but they are different species similarly lion tiger and cheetah they belong to the same family but they are of different species and that's why they are considered as the species diversity and the next one is the ecosystem diversity that means in an ecosystem what are the different varieties of the animals and plants living over there so they will be considered as the ecosystem diversity so what are the values of biodiversity first of all it is important to our survival so they are really important for us to survive on the earth secondly it is important also for the health and healing it is also important for the health healing because we get a lot of medicines and other things from these plants and animals so they are also important for the health and healing third is ethical and aesthetical values because they give aesthetical values as well as ethical values to the environment what about the productive values because we get several products from the forest from the jungle so they are also important for the productive values and lastly they also provide the ecological services like plants like animals they help in regulating the water cycle they help in regulating the carbon cycle they help in regulating in the nitrogen cycle so they also provide the ecological services to the environment 